Hello, hello, who of you, and welcome to another podcast episode. Long time no listen. I I think we all will agree it is a long time no listen. So here is the news. Uh, Jodie Whittaker drops a hint about the new Christmas special. Um, I don't know. I don't want to know any hints. Um, here's one I'm quite interested in. It's a big finish. Related story. Doctor Who's David Tennant and Alex Kingston return for a new 10th Doctor in River Song Adventure. Ever wonder what happened? I don't want to take a survey radio times. No. What happened between the Doctor and River in their early adventures? Hello, sweetie. In a surprise Doctor reunion, David and fan favourite 10th Doctor is set up with Alex Kingston River Song for a new series of adventures filled in the fill in the gaps of the relationship previous self which is on the eight episode Silent in the Library slash um Frost of the Dead. Related by the audio drama company Big Finish and recorded re- and recorded. Doctor Who <laughs> the tenth doc Doctor and Rivers and Will Star will star Ten and Kingston in a collection of stories set after their meeting, but before Rivers' adventures with Matt Smith, 11th Doctor, as dispatched on in the 2010-2013 series. Cool. I can't let me just adjust. Hey, Joss! Just adjust the mic. Um, uh, any other new... New episode of Doctor Who magazine. New episode. New issue of the Doctor Who magazine. I don't know how well you can hear me. Um. Oh, I don't want to listen to the big fini- to the uh, Radio Times podcast. No, I don't. Uh, it, David Ten. Uh, Doctor Who can. Uh, right. What's next? Because there aren't many interesting articles, as you can tell. Does a new Doctor Who Dalek design create a loophole? I want to see this new Dalek design. Ooh. Um, is that it? Are we, are we telling me that's it? Are we? Because that looks very familiar. Oh, it is. Um, I'll describe it to you, podcast listeners. Uh, and because... I haven't worked out what to do for the visuals yet for the YouTube channel. I haven't thought of a cool image and thing to put on because all you can see is the word Doctor discussion and there's nothing really interesting going on. There isn't like, there isn't something you can look at whilst listening to me rambling about Doctor Who. If you have any thoughts, leave your thoughts in the comment section down below on YouTube. Thank you. Uh, Doctor Who page, which is like a fan page. A photo has been leaked online of the new Dalek design from the upcoming festive special resolution of the Dalek. What, what are your thoughts? Well, the bit near the head's a bit thin, and is that so that it can run fa- Is that so it can, it can glide faster? Is that what we're saying? But it's alright. I mean, I'm not fussed. A Dalek's a Dalek. The cool, but yeah. Uh, wait, what? Why am I reading this about? It says, "Big Bang Theory is plot hole, huge error, huge error in Sheldon's Doctor Who routine exposed." Doctor what? Uh, well. The American times are different to the British time, so they go off, so they'll be watching early in the morning instead of late in the evening like we do. Um, same with Australia, actually. Uh, any more news? Uh Who could Bradley Walsh? Oh. This is something. Who could replace Bradley Walsh and Tolson Cole in Doctor Who? Rumours that there've been a spare slot in the TARDIS soon, but which actors 
could accompany Jodie Whittaker's Doctor. Well, we all know why Bradley Walsh has left to go and film a reboot. I'm telling you, a reboot doesn't deserve a reboot of Dali Buds and Me. And, um, which I'm not too chuffed about, but he plays the titular character played by David Jason. And now, I am very annoyed about that, but it depends on who wrote it and, and that. So, only, only time could tell. So, after two years with the same uh, central cast, could Doctor Who be looking for new blood? The question is, who's following rumours that currently, current companion Brown Lodge and Tosin Paul are on their way out of the TARDIS, with, with the pair possibly set to depart, depart the BBC sci-fi series in upcoming festive special. If true, the rumours suggest that Colin Walsh will be leaving to take a big new TV role while his fellow time travel Van Dip Gale, who plays a uh, trainee police officer Yaz, Yaz Khan, will continue appearing alongside the Doctor. And you know what this means, the first time in a while there's an open slot or two in Whitaker's TARDIS team. So the new, actress c- the new actor could join the fan, fam. Well, I don't like the word fam. I hate it. Uh, I really do hear the word fam. Uh, could could we expect some familiar faces from recent episodes or complete newcomers? And how would they fit into the Doctor Who dynamic? In a list carefully selected by RadioTime.com editors, we've assembled a few rumours and a few riders below. John Barryman is Captain Jack Hartnett. People, people are rumouring this. This is the key piece of Doctor Why do I keep a look at and looking at the camera? This is a key piece of Doctor Who rumourage. So, as at, at this stage, it's looking fairly likely that we'll see John Barrowman in more, more time, more danger. And Torchwood needs to come back then. If they bring in Jack back, they need to bring Torchwood back. As in, as in, um, Whatever she's got, Gwen. Gwen Cooper needs to come back early. Because Gwen's the only surviving member of the British, of the Welsh branch of Torchwood. Because they have the London branch, but not many people talk about the London branch ever. Um, But this could just be uh, the rumour. John. John. uh, I don't don't even know. It's that woman from, from the. I can't remember. Thank you all for seeing the journey. Everything did for it all. Uh, I'd say Paradox, or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. Hopefully, she'll be here in the tide. It's kind of quite good. Uh, um, no, I'm, I'm not agreeing with it. I'm not agreeing with most of the. I, I, first of all, I can't really pronounce them very well because I'm not the best pronouncer. But. I'm also not agreeing with any of this. Oh, Will Miller, who is in no offence, two pints of a lager. Yeah, Larry Lamb. Larry Lamb would. Well, that's the thing. If Bradley Walsh can do it, because Bradley Walsh is 60, so can Larry Lamb. Come on, Larry Lamb. Um, neither old is. Uh, oh, and finally, someone we never expect. When it's coming, when new Doctor is coming to Doctor Who, you make a few educated guesses, but it comes to Companion, it's much harder to pick who is in the next. After all, she was revealed in 2016, she could, she could have guessed Pearl Mackey, who had, who had next to no screen credit at this time, who would be Peter Capaldi's new co-star. And that's about to- and what about Tulsa and Amanda before they were announced? No one saw it coming. Sure, Bradley Walsh involvement had leaked out, but in casting newcomers, Doctor Who was often kept as a surprise. Now, if we get returning companions, such as the titular character, Bill, because Bill's dead, but Bill is still possibly could come back. So could Clara, because Clara went off with me, as in the character me, which is 
very confusing in, in, in a TARDIS, so could happen. Could happen. Uh, 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 any more news? Any more new news? news? Uh, Doctor Who and the BBC series. Very educational. Dullity, dullity, dullity. Do do. La la la. Trying to find morning. La la la. Oh, my Doctor Who returned. Confirmed and Jazz Stars revealed. Right. Thank you, guys. Right. Right. Well, that's all the news we have for this week because uh, I don't want to go all the way down to page 13. I might just click on page 13. Yep, yeah, they're all actual Doctor related news, not Doctor Who. Anyway, guys, we just. Yeah. Uh, anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video, listening to this video. Any suggestions of how I could. Uh, make it more interesting for the fans watching it. Uh, any any way of any new things like different, um, different what you call it, different images popping up or different videos you want me to to briefly uh, attend to, like film to make it look better, to make it just less of a one still image. Any suggestions really will be. Uh, greatly added. So, anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you've enjoyed listening to me rambling on about Doctor Who news. We'll be back pretty much in another month because if we do it every week, we get less news and it'll be more boring. But if we do it on a monthly basis, we get more news. More news. So, Stay tuned for the very next episode of Doctor Who, Who Discussions. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. Time, Lord, time out. I'm here. Let me try and get to the record button. Time, Lord, time out. Bye.